that I decided to record this video, of course, the rain has come and I'm going to get soaked, but I'm going to persevere because I do want to share with you some of Tom's driftwood artwork. I think it's time that I gave you a little tour because you noted the other day, uh, perhaps on the duvet video that he made that bed that was in her, our room. And I just thought it would be time to sh show some other things. So here's a gate that he created a few years ago. I love it. It is so beautiful. And when he was creating it, it was just a, a massive beast in our garage. And now this is the inside of it. And we'll take a walk through and I'll show you the other side, which I adore. So here we go. Flip the gate. Let's come on through. And there it is. And it was actually featured in a newspaper article, which is really, really nice. We didn't even know about it. We opened up the newspaper and there it was. All right, let's take a walk and look at some of the sculptures. He spends a lot of time creating Zen in our world. And it's just something as simple as this garden area where he just placed random pieces of wood and they're really beautiful. And there's our mermaid <laughs> that came with the house. All right, let's take a walk around the other side. Yay! This one is not made out of driftwood. However, it was a project that we built together. I'm not even going to take credit. That's a joke. I helped him kind of some of the time. <laughs> let's take a walk inside because it's really great. So look at this detailing. The handle just lifts up like that. Let me go in. Whoop. <laughs> Whoops. I don't know my own strength. And then he's got this where you can hang your towel. And then when you come in here, let's go and see. He's got little windows. Look at that. And then this was a really another nice touch, a wall of stone. The ultimate spa experience. <laughs> let's go. Come with me. Let's go see some other things. <laughs> okay, here we go. I'm flip the camera around for this one because you need to see the breadth of this fence. And this started with one panel and it evolved into what you see here. Wow. And it goes on and on and on. And this was the last panel he created and this was done prior to the gate, and I think it's where his, his idea for the gate may have been born. We have our kayak just temporarily hanging out over here. And let me turn us around because this is the best part. Are you ready? Ta-da! Here are the sculptures. The child the dad and the mom <laughs> with the sun shining on them and this is a dock that he designed which is very different from the docks that we've seen around us because they all have those if you look pilings sticking up uh, above and this is just flush and smooth and very peaceful and zen like and we love it so that's the birds getting involved and now here's the video that I created for his website and his work to tell his story. And if you tune in this weekend, there might be a little something special coming in the raffle bonus round. I'll leave it at that.